Surviving the recent shutdown of Harley-Davidson plants in Wauwatosa and Kansas City, the workers at the Menominee Falls plant are survivors, but some aren't sure how long they can hold out. So I don't know if they're trying to push all the older people out. There's already not that many left. This worker didn't want to be identified, but is among a group who've begun protesting daily at the plant during their off hours, with the end of a seven-year contract looming Monday. The company is still bargaining with the union. We have no contract offer. We have no vote date. We have nothing. While most workers have no choice but to wait to see what happens, those eligible for retirement have been given a Friday deadline to decide whether to retire under the current contract terms or wait, not knowing what retirement under the new contract might look like. So it's kind of like a bad game show. Do you want what you have now or do you want to trade it for door number three? <laughs> And you don't know what's behind them. Absolutely not. Yes, we do not. We do not. Only in her upper 50s, she's not ready to retire, but may decide to, to protect the retirement benefits as they are now. What are you going to do? I don't know. Ask me Friday before 5 p.m. Nick, what is Harley Davidson saying about the deadline? Well, they did confirm for me that they are in negotiations on a new labor agreement and that the one is expiring on Monday. They tell me that they are bargaining in good faith, but can't provide any additional details. Nick Bohr reporting live in Menominee Falls.